dear children today again i will give few solutions from the exercise relation which i have finished in the live class now the last question which i have explained you was the question number 5 now i will start from the here itself the question is r is the relation and the relation values are given and the set is given as 1 2 3 4 this is the given set and this is the relation given from this given set what you have to prove is you have to check whether this particular relation is reflexive symmetry or transitive so one by one we can check now you know that for reflexive for a reflexive we must have 1 1 Or two comma two, or so on, which must belongs to the given set. Now you can check these values because these values are in the given set. So you can check one one is there, two two is there, four four is there, three three is there. So all the same values are mentioned. So this particular relation is reflexive. Therefore, reflexive. Clear? Now you can come to symmetry. what is the property of symmetry if 1 comma 2 if then 2 comma 1 must be in the given set is it so 1 2 is there 1 2 is here so 2 1 must be here anywhere 2 1 nowhere now you can check other one for example 1 3 if 1 3 is in the relation so 3 1 must be there anywhere nowhere 3 2 is here Since three two is here, so two three. If two three must be anywhere, then it might be a symmetry. So you can check that no any relations are looking here as A B then B A. There is no any such type of relations are mentioned. So it is not symmetry. Clear to all of you? Now third property is transitive. transitive what is the property of transitive transitive is if a comma b and b comma c then a comma c this is the property this must be in the given relation if this and this ye dono hona chahiye to ye bhi hoga ab dekhiye a comma b ab dhyan se is pure relation ko check kare dekhiye yahan pe 1 comma 3 1 comma 3 to ye ab yahan se kya aana chahiye 3 se aur 1 comma 3 to 3 comma 2 to 1 comma 2 yahan pe dekhiye this is first part this is second part and this is third part clear you can check here 1 then 3 2 and 3 2 then 1 comma 2 since the every terms are coming in this particular relation therefore transitive समझ में बात सो दिस पर्टिकुलर रिलेशन इज रिफ्लेक्सिव रिफ्लेक्सिव एज वेल एज ट्रांजिटिव सो दिस इज द पर्टिकुलर आंसर ऑफ दिस पर्टिकुलर क्वेश्चन क्लियर नाउ आई विल टेक वन मोर क्वेश्चन दिस इज द क्वेश्चन नंबर फाइव now see one question number 6 also very good question this is also let us see so that the relation r in the set a of real numbers first mention what is given set a is a real number what type of set we have a real number what is the relation a relation r is given as ab such that A is less than or equal to B. आप क्या प्रूफ करना है? Is reflexive and transitive but not symmetry. You from this particular relation and from this particular set you have to prove. So one by one I will explain everything. First check the reflexive. Reflexive. So what is the property of reflexive? Reflexive is A must be related to A. That is. A comma A must belongs to the given set. ये property में लिखा है. अब यहाँ पे देखिए R. What is R here? R is less than or equal to. So A is 
लेस देन और इक्वल टू ए अब इनमें से कोई भी एक ट्रू होगा तो ट्रू हो जाएगा ए इज लेस देन ए नो बट ए माइट बी इक्वल टू ए डेफिनेटली ए इज इक्वल टू ए देयरफॉर इट इज रिफ्लेक्सिव समझ गए यू कैन टेक वन एग्जांपल लेट ए इज इक्वल टू 1 व्हिच बिलोंग्स टू द गिवन सेट मैं एक एग्जांपल समझाता हूं वन क्या है एक रियल नंबर है अब इस वैल्यू को यहीं पुट कर दीजिए वन इज लेस देन और इक्वल टू वन बिकॉज ए इज लेस देन और इक्वल टू बी यहां ए की वैल्यू भी वन होगी बी की वैल्यू भी वन होगी बिकॉज रिफ्लेक्सिव में दोनों सेम होना चाहिए वन इज लेस देन वन नो बट वन इज इक्वल टू वन यस दे आर दिस इंप्लाइज इट इज रिफ्लेक्सिव क्लियर Now take symmetry. What is the property of symmetry? If A is less than or equal to B, then B must be less than or equal to A. ये property होनी चाहिए symmetry की. Now you can check. Let A as one and B as two. You can take and A and B belongs to the given set. Because both are real number. Now you can put in this particular equation. A less than or equal to B. Now A is one, B is two. So what happened? One is less than or equal to two. क्या one two से छोटा है? Definitely. बराबर नहीं है लेकिन छोटा है. Then, but whether two is also less than or equal to one, so two is neither less nor equal. Therefore, it is not symmetric. क्लियर हो गया जो भी आप आप अपने से कोई भी वैल्यू ले सकते हैं और इस पर्टिकुलर इक्वेशन में पुट करके चेक कर सकते हैं दिस इज ओपन फॉर एवरीवन यू कैन टेक बाय योर ओन सो इट इज नॉट सिमेट्री नाउ कम्स टू ट्रांजिटिव ट्रांजिटिव व्हाट इज द प्रॉपर्टी ऑफ ट्रांजिटिव इफ ए इज लेस देन इक्वल टू बी एंड बी इज लेस देन इक्वल टू सी देन ए इज लेस देन और इक्वल टू सी अगर ये दोनों ट्रू है तो ये भी ट्रू होना चाहिए यू टेक वन एग्जाम्पल बाई योर ओन लेट ए एज वन बी एज टू एंड सी एज थ्री एंड दिस ऑल बिलोंग्स टू द गिवन सेट इस सेट रियल नंबर वाले ही टर्म्स लेने हैं आपको नाउ चेक वन इज लेस देन और इक्वल टू टू डेफिनेटली वन इज लेस देन टू एंड टू इज लेस देन और इक्वल टू थ्री डेफिनेटली टू इज लेस देन थ्री देन A A means one. One is less than or equal to three, which is always true. In both of these, A is true. Not true. Therefore, it is transitive. Clear? So I have taken example also and clarified with the formula also. So please go through very clearly. So this was a good question. I will take one more question. So this was question number six. Now I will explain one more question. Then the rest of the questions I will give you for your homework. Now take one very much similar. Take question number seven. Question number seven. Once again, set is defined as set A as the real number. Same. What is the set? Set as the real number. And relation is relation A. रिलेशन आर इज गिवन एज वॉट इज द रिलेशन गिवेन ए कॉमा बी सच दैट ए इज लेस देन और इक्वल टू बी स्क्वायर क्या प्रूफ करना है इट इज नाइदर नाइदर रिफ्लेक्सिव नॉर सिमेट्री नॉर ट्रांजिटिव इज इट नॉर नाउ वन थिंग यू हैव टू बी वेरी केयरफुल वाई इज सॉल्विंग रिलेशन क्वेश्चन In this question and the previous question, it was given so that. So means आपको prove करना है. There are might be few examples which are real numbers and which fulfill this condition. But you have to take those examples which will satisfy the condition of neither. Understood everyone? आपको उन्हीं examples को consider करना है, उन्हीं properties को लेना है जो इस condition को fulfill करते हैं. क्या fulfill करना है? That it is neither reflexive nor symmetry nor transitive. Now take example. Start with reflexive. What is the property of reflexive? A must be 
लेस देन और इक्वल टू ए स्क्वायर देखिए यहां पे जो ये दो टर्म है एक आप यहां रखेंगे और एक बार यहां रखेंगे दैट इज ए कॉमा ए बिलोंग्स टू सेट ये मैंने प्रॉपर्टी लिखा है नाउ इफ यू टेक ए एज 1 सो दिस विल ट्रू सो टेक लेट ए एज 1 बाय 2 and 1 by 2 belongs to the given set 1 by 2 is a real number clear ab is prop values ko yahan put kar dijiye where 1 by 2 are means less than or equal to b b ki value fir se hum kya lenge 1 by 2 that is 1 by 4 samajh mein aaya sabko ek bar a aur yahan bhi a hai because reflexive mein dono same value hone chahiye humne a ki jagah 1 by 2 liya so 1 by 2 is less than 1 by 4 never 1 by 2 is greater 1 by 2 is equal to 1 by 4 no therefore it is not reflexive clear to all of you now take symmetry what is symmetry if a is less than or equal to b then b is less than or equal to a yahan pe square hai term ye le chala maine ye formula note kar raha hai if this is there then it must be symmetry now take example a as 1 and b as 2 maine aapko bataya hai ki ye jo example main le raha hu consider kar raha hu values ye aap apne se le sakte hain you can check by your own and it must satisfy the condition now a is 1 so 1 is less than or equal to b b ki value kya hai 2 2 ka square so 1 is less than 2 square that is 4 definitely if then a b ki jagah hum kya lenge 2 is less than or equal to 1 square samajh mein aayi baat if 1 is less than 2 square jo ki sahi hai then 2 is less than 1 square neither it is less nor it is equal this is not therefore not symmetry clear now the last property is transitive transitive what is the property of transitive if a is less than or equal to b and b is less than or equal to c then a is less than or equal to c is it but yahan values kya le lena aapko b square so for transitive let a is ab yahan pe aapko apne se lena hoga if you will take simply so it will not fulfill so you have to think twice and thrice then you consider so take a as 25 b as 6 and c as 3 i have taken these values and these all values belongs to the real number now the what is the property of transitive a is less than or equal to b square so 25 is less than or equal to b square that is 6 square then if this and ye dono true hona chahiye please be aware of first two condition must be true for transitive if this and second kya hai 6 is less than or equal to 3 square then what is a 25 is less than or equal to 3 square samajh mein aa gaya sabko dhyan se dekhiye 25 is less than 36 yes 6 is less than 9 yes but whether 25 is less than 9 no whether 25 is equal to 9 no so this is not true therefore not transitive so this was the proof required you have to prove that this particular relation is neither reflexive nor symmetry nor transitive so you have to consider such examples such values from the real number which fulfill the required condition clear to all of you so these are the few examples i have explained from the exercise now while a few questions are left please do by your own all right now in the live class i will take few examples and i will revise the whole things which i have taught to you in so many days thank you